Um, you know how annoying it is when your internet connection goes down? Well, imagine if it went down because of Good Morning Britain. A couple in Wales has well, wiped just out Good Morning Britain, their entire 400-strong villages broadband every single morning for the past 18 months. Alan and Elaine Rees, who are in this morning's Sun newspaper, were unaware that old TV was causing all the problems <laughs> for their neighbours. And it turns out the issue was me. Because Alan and Elaine, who join us now live from their home in Aberhosen, uh, Paris, they, they were tuning in at 7 o'clock in the morning to hear me, weren't you? <laughs> oh, yes, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to interrupt your knitting here, uh, but... <laughs> Elaine, tell me what happened. You guys were every morning... It's not knitting. <laughs> what are you doing? Is it knitting? Switching the telly on. Yeah. Every no, it's morning. Crochet. Crochet, crochet, got it. So my apologies. So every morning at seven o'clock, you guys turn on Good Morning Britain, yeah? Oh yes, definitely. And Especially why... when you're on it. Thank you, Ella. Well, thank you. It's, it's great to meet a super fan. Um, but it turned out every <laughs> time you said, "Will you put the check in the post?" <laughs> 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 but it turned out, Elaine, that every time you turned on the TV, you two you were wiping out your entire <laughs> village's internet connection every day. Yeah, apparently so, but we didn't know. <laughs> Can you tell us how you found out? Yeah. Um, well, it was one morning, we were sitting in bed watching you on the telly, and um, <laughs> we heard some people talking outside, and it was like the... Um, BT open reach people. Uh, they were walking around with a meter and uh, sort of they stopped outside our house and pointed the meter at us. And sort of we went and talked to them and they said, Your television is causing uh, a breakdown in the internet. Can you, <laughs> can you uh, switch it off? So we switched it off and the internet came back on, apparently. And uh, so he says, Do you mind not using this television anymore? And we said, Oh, all right. Um, that was it. <laughs> and, and Alan... <laughs> you didn't um, hear a thing afterwards of them. <laughs> Alan, how did your neighbours... Alan the other doesn't village... want to talk with you. Alan oh. doesn't want to talk? Not with you. <laughs> no. No? No, he's shy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't blame you, Alan. Frankly. Alan, it's your big moment. You're on national TV. You don't want to talk yeah. to me. <laughs> no. <laughs> well... Yeah. I, we didn't say anything to the neighbours, really. Yeah. Well, we never thought about it. We never it. thought anything about it. When they when they it, found so, out when they found out Alan just, that you were the ones <laughs> when they found out you were the ones causing all the problem with their internet, were they angry with you or not? Well, I don't think anybody found out till, till yesterday. Well, <laughs> until yesterday. <laughs> when all this went viral. Yeah, but everything went viral yesterday. Well, let me know. Well, just yeah. just keep, well, we're going to come have a short break, and we're going to come back to you after break. I want a, I want a longer conversation yeah. with you. We'll come back to you in a moment. See you in a moment. OK, OK. OK, well, Alan and Elaine uh, Rees from Paris are still with us. Uh, Elaine, you're getting a huge reaction from the British public. They're <laughs> loving the fact that you are doing your crochet... The most laid-back ..in your first major had. television interview <laughs> and that Alan doesn't really want to talk at all. <laughs> no. Um, so I need to find out a bit more about you, Elaine. No, he doesn't want to, no. 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 Elaine, you were a GP receptionist, well, I hear, he, in he a GP surgery. He doesn't even get a chance. Yeah, Elaine. Yes. OK, here's yes, how... Yes, I was a bit of a dragon, I think. <laughs> Now, Elaine, here's what happens. I'm going to ask you a question. You have to wait to hear it. Then you reply. Yeah. You may have then, to wait a long time. Because there's a slight delay, so we're talking over each other. So I want to know this, Elaine. Um, what do you like on TV? What do you like watching? Um, documentaries. Yeah? You? <laughs> Me and documentaries. Um, uh, yes. Why, yes. why do you like? Why like, do you like watching? Uh, why of, do you like watching um, me, Elaine? Because you make me laugh <laughs> and cross. <laughs> when, when do I make you cross? When you won't let Susanna talk. Oh, <laughs> round of applause to Elaine. <laughs> A woman's woman. There we go. Welcome, Elaine. Welcome. We thought you were a Piers super fan, but. 
actually, you're a great supporter of me, and but, I really by the appreciate way, pretty it. Pretty rich coming from you, given Alan doesn't talk either. <laughs> I haven't seen him get a word in. No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Alan. Alan, d does, does Elaine treat you like I treat I'm Susanna? Elaine. Yes. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. Oh, I love no. you too. Definitely not. El Elaine, look, you worked in a GP uh, receptionist. What do, you, what do you make of what's going on with this pandemic? Oh gosh, I don't, uh, I don't know what to think. It's, it, it's. I, I, I just can't think of words to describe what's going on. Mm. Um, I'm glad I'm not working anymore because the poor girls in the, um, in the doctor surgery, they're having, um, hard time with everybody, um, sort of demanding this and demanding that, and they, the abuse they get is terrible. Mm. My daughter works there, and, you know, people. Are just horrible. Really? So, isn't that disgusting, mm. isn't it? What do you think of Boris Johnson? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> I'm not going to say anything about him. Alan? I think Alan wants to jump like in. It looks like you'd like to say something. Wales. No, not, not really, but uh, I'm not into politics at, at all myself. No, what are you into? I don't believe in politics. What are you into, <laughs> Alan? Well, I just like. I just like my tractor and things. I've got a vintage tractor and things like that. A big tractor, really? And the family. Yeah, because you, you used to work on a farm, right? Yeah. 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 Yes. Uh, uh, what do you and like? I, I bought myself an old... Uh, vin Go on. I, I bought myself an old vintage tractor. Fabulous. A few years ago. Fabulous. So I... Yeah, that's... I love that, I do. That's, oh, my, uh, do that's actually... my hobby. What do you do with it? You we just drive it around? around or... the country on it. Yeah, you just drive it around? Yes. Brilliant. Yeah, yeah we go... a tractor run sometimes. Yeah. Uh, Elaine, can I we ask you, Elaine? The country, Elaine? I, I sit in the back. Yeah, doing your crocheting? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Really? So I'm Alan drives yes, the tractor. Blanket. Alan drives the tractor yes. and you sit in the back doing your crocheting? <laughs> Well, yes, basically. I think we should... <laughs> We've got a, a camper van that we have actually made up ourselves and I do sit in the dry, in the passenger seat crocheting when Alan's driving the camper van. <laughs> and what are you actually <laughs> crocheting at the moment, <laughs> Elaine? What are you making? It's a, it's a blank... It's a blanket. Oh, look at that! It's lovely. Amazing. It's got a kind of Mexican feel to it. Like a sombrero. Yeah, this one behind is a. This yeah. is I've made this one as well. Oh, fantastic! Fantastic! If anybody is tuning yeah. in and, and yeah. wondering about this interview, uh, just to explain <laughs> that the reason we're talking to Alan and Elaine Reese is not because originally because of the vintage tractor, but because of the vintage television set that you bought on Facebook, thirty pounds. Uh, enjoyed watching Good Morning Britain for a year and a half until you were told that the power, the signal, was interfering with the village's internet connection. 400 villagers all complaining every morning. And at 7 o'clock, their internet connection went down when you switched us on. Um, have you got yourselves a new television, guys? Yes. Yes. Is it a good... We Is bought it... one straight away because we binned the other one as soon as we knew. <laughs> Alan, have you got a big TV? Yeah, have you got well, a really we were good told one or not? That it was affecting. No. Would you? <laughs> no, would you like a tiny one? one. Would a tiny one? <laughs> would you like a big one, Alan? Like your yes. tractor? <laughs> yes. Yes. I'm going to get yes. you a big. <laughs> yes. We are going to get you on behalf of the show a big TV. All right, a massive one, like your tractor. Piers is paying for it. All right, so that you can see my, you can see me even bigger in your room every morning. That's just what you want. Would you like that, Elaine? That's, well, that's I was just going to say, it, it, it'll be a bit of a nightmare, won't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, perhaps we should get you a smaller one. <laughs> um, Elaine and Alan, it's absolutely lovely to talk to you this morning. <laughs> um, you're, you're a bright spot in the gloom, especially we're, with the colours in that blanket. You've I'm done just going to read you. Elaine. Before we let you go, I'm going to read you some comments from the viewers. That couple on GMB with a dodgy telly are brilliant, says Danielle. Luke on Twitter, can we have Elaine and Alan on every morning, please? <laughs> Uh, James on Twitter, the funniest couple well, ever yeah, on GMB, definitely. doing crocheting while being interviewed while her husband refuses to speak. <laughs> Tanya on Twitter, crying laughing at the couple in Wales with the TV. 
Love it. Everyone's loving you, Elaine. What do you make of that? You're a star. Both of you. Oh. Well, there you are, then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, very nice. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Be I very happy. I yeah. Was You're going to be the most <laughs> famous people in your village, Alan, about after the, this. Uh, television. <laughs> it's great to yes. see. Yeah. Gogglebox yeah. yeah. beckons. That's good. <laughs> Alan, do you think you'll be able to cope with the fame coming your no, way now? No, no. <laughs> oh, well, yes, they I, I, ho I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, listen, I don't really want to leave you. I'd love to have you on all show, nice but we're going to leave you. But first of all, we're going to get uh, Laura to give you a personal weather forecast for your area. Would you like that? Oh, yes, yes, yes. please. Because you'll be out on the tractor sun. later, so... <laughs> Give Alan and Elaine a personal forecast, please, Laura. Yeah. They probably know this from looking out of their window, uh, <laughs> but it is raining and it's going to rain all morning, but it will be brighter this afternoon. Yes. But yes. you've brightened our day no matter what. Oh, <laughs> isn't that lovely? <laughs> oh, thank you. That's yes, lovely. You. That's good. E Elaine, yeah. what's the most annoying thing about Very Alan? Very good team. Um... Uh, he can't hear me half the time because he doesn't put his hearing aid in. <laughs> and, and Alan, what's the most annoying thing about Elaine? And they call that. <laughs> <laughs> she keeps talking. It, it, honestly, it's like watching us. Yes. How, but it is like watching us. It is, it is, we're like an old married couple. <laughs> How long have you two been married? Um, 45 years. Wow. And it, and was Fantastic. it love at first sight, Alan? Yeah. Yeah. Really? <laughs> yes. Aww. Yeah, we've been together since just before I was 15. Oh. We got engaged when I was 16. We got married when I was 18. And we had our first child when we were 21. Fantastic. And what's so, the secret... Alan, what's the secret time. of... What's the secret of a happy marriage? Uh, you don't listen to the wife. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he turns his well, hearing you know aid off. That's exactly the same uh, philosophy I have about my TV wife. <laughs> Never listen to a word she says. Just yap, yap, yeah. yap all the time. Uh, me? Well, you don't, give, you, you, don't yeah. give, you don't give her a chance. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, Elaine, what Elaine. would you say is the it's secret like, of a happy like marriage? She never finishes a sentence. <laughs> Elaine, what's the secret of a happy yeah. marriage? Poor Susanna never finishes a sentence. <laughs> barely start oh. one most mornings. Um... <laughs> Yeah, what do you call it? Um, what, what, can I, what can I think? I says just be together. You, you do know? seem very if well suited, I have out, to say. You fall out. You seem very well suited. Yeah, well. Yeah. Well. But I get... The reason she's still with me, I always give her the money. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, definitely. My wages, always. How, yeah. how much do you yeah. give her a week, then, yeah. Alan? I'm in charge of the bank card. Oh. I... I, I he doesn't know. I, I don't know. It's, <laughs> my money's with her. Yeah, I'm in charge of the bank card. Yeah. <laughs> now, we've got some breaking news for you, both of you. I don't because, think I've... Because you've been so great, we're going to send Andy yeah. Peters. You know Andy Peters, our competition guy? Yes. yes. We're going to send him with yes. a 65-inch TV down to your house next week. Oh. 4K, Ultra HD. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You'll be able to see the full glory of me on your massive oh. screen. Well, there you are. Lovely. Oh. That will be lovely. Thank well, you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Brilliant. Listen, Brilliant. you've been one, two of my favourite guests ever. Brilliant. I think I speak on behalf of the whole team when I yeah. say thank you for thank giving you. us what we needed, a damn good laugh this morning. Yeah. Thank you to Elaine and Alan. Enjoy your new TV. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And, uh, Andy Peters will be in your house next week. We'll do it Thank live you. on TV. I love and it. We'll, and we'll have fun with you again next week, all right? Oh, my. Oh. Oh, okay, Lovely. Bye -bye. Thank you very Thank much. You. No, Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with the crocheting. And, Elaine, thank That's you it. for speaking up for me. I appreciate it. <laughs> well, you know, us women have got to stick together, <laughs> haven't we? Yeah. Well, right, well, right, right. Elaine. <laughs> Lovely to see you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Lovely to talk to you. And see Th you. Thank you. Thank you both. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> oh, see you next week, Fantastic. guys. Fantastic. Brilliant. What a lovely couple. Brilliant. And the fact that every morning they were together. turning on to watch us, well, me, and, uh, and the entire village's it internet us. would power out every day yeah. <laughs> for 18 months. Turn Piers Morgan off! <laughs>
We ought to interview some of the other villagers and see how yeah. how much they've enjoyed. If you think Alan doesn't want to talk to you, the rest of the village Elaine doesn't want to talk to you. Elaine was looking at me. Uh, fantastic. Anyway, we'll, we'll have fun with them next week. Andy Peters, go down, big TV. Huh? Be fun. So good, so good. We love Elaine and Alan.